Maltose or, also known as maltobios or malt sugar, is a disaccharide formed from two units of glucose joined with an alpha bond. In the isomer isomaltose, the two glucose molecules are joined with an alpha bond. Maltose is the two-unit member of the amylose homologous series, the key structural motif of starch. When beta amylase breaks down starch, it removes two glucose units at a time, producing maltose. An example of this reaction is found in germinating seeds, which is why it was named after malt. Unlike sucrose, it is a reducing sugar. History Maltose was discovered by Augustin Pierre de Brunfot, although this discovery was not widely accepted until it was confirmed in 1872 by Irish chemist and brewer Cornelius O'Sullivan. Its name comes from malt, combined with the suffix os, which is used in names of sugars. Maltose making and use in China goes as far back as the Shang dynasty. In Japan, the use of maltose has been recorded since the period of Emperor Jima. Topic: <laughs> Structure and nomenclature. Maltose is a disaccharide. The carbohydrates are generally divided into monosaccharides, oligosaccharides, and polysaccharides depending on the number of sugar subunits. Maltose, with two sugar units, is an oligosaccharide, specifically a disaccharide, because it consists of two glucose molecules. Glucose is a hexose, a monosaccharide containing six carbon atoms. The two glucose units are in the pyranose form and are joined by an O-glycosidic bond, with the first carbon C1 of the first glucose linked to the fourth carbon C4 of the second glucose, indicated as 1,4. The link is characterized as alpha because the glycosidic bond to the anomeric carbon C1 is in the opposite plane from the CH2OH substituent in the same ring C6 of the first glucose. If the glycosidic bond to the anomeric carbon C1 were in the same plane as the CH2OH substituent, it would be classified as a beta bond, and the resulting molecule would be cellobios. The anomeric carbon C1 of the second glucose molecule, which is not involved in a glycosidic bond, could be either an alpha or beta anomer depending on the bond direction of the attached hydroxyl group relative to the CH2OH substituent of the same ring, resulting in either alpha maltose or beta maltose. An isomer of maltose is isomaltose. This is similar to maltose but instead of a bond in the alpha position, it is in the alpha position, the same bond that is found at the branch points of glycogen and amylopectin. <laughs> Properties Like glucose, maltose is a reducing sugar, because the ring of one of the two glucose units can open to present a free aldehyde group, the other one cannot because of the nature of the glycosidic bond. Maltose can be broken down to glucose by the maltase enzyme, which catalyses the hydrolysis of the glycosidic bond. Maltose in aqueous solution exhibits mutarotation, because the alpha and beta isomers that are formed by the different conformations of the anomeric carbon have different specific rotations, and in aqueous solutions, these two forms are in equilibrium. It has a sweet taste, but is only about 30-60% as sweet as sugar, depending on the concentration. A 10% solution of maltose is 35% as sweet as sucrose. Sources and absorption Maltose is a component of malt, a substance which is obtained in the process of allowing grain to soften in water and germinate. It is also present in highly variable quantities in partially hydrolyzed starch products like maltodextrin, corn syrup and acid-thin starch. In humans, maltose is broken down by various maltase enzymes, providing two glucose molecules which can be further processed, either broken down to provide energy, or stored as glycogen. The lack of the sucrase isomaltase enzyme in humans causes sucrose intolerance, but because there are four different maltase enzymes, complete maltose intolerance is extremely rare. <laughs> 